And we're back for a second half. Jamaica up 2-1 going into the second half. First game for Jamaica, third game for Hungary of this 2018 Heritage Cup. Providence, Rhode Island. Beautiful Saturday, sunny day. Sunday doesn't look like it might be so perfect, but you know, we'll get through it. That's lacrosse. We're just happy to have a little bit of sunshine while we have it. So White gets the initial clamp and it kicks across to gain the advantage. Referee turns it over and says, no, 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 you cannot do that. Jamaica is one of the more anticipated newcomers to the 2018 World Lacrosse Championships in Netanya, Israel this coming summer. It will be their first ever FIL event. They have had Jamaican Heritage teams here at this event before. There was a Jamaican Heritage team at the Lasnai tournament on the Onondaga Nation, but this will be the first sanctioned FIL championship that Jamaica will be taking part of July 12th through 21st in Netanya, Israel. But today we're on the campus. And, and there's a bounce shot. We're on the campus of Johnson & Wales College in Providence, Rhode Island. We've got eight international teams gathered for four day Nin tournament. 19 in gold with that bounce shot. Take, pays the price for it, but uh, well worth it. It was a great body check by the Hungarian defender, but a little too late. 19, 19. you said it was Clifford Kirker. Gives Jamaica a 3-1 lead. Excellent power stance by the official. <laughs> Oops. Good contested ground ball here. Hungary that comes up hungry. able to pull it away. Do the smart thing and take a breath. I haven't seen uh, the Hungarian offense yet this half. That could be. I believe that I believe we're lucky they're on this field. Uh, that might have been a turnover on the turf field. Hungary gets their offense personnel on and starts to go to work here. Big, big save by the Jamaican goalie. I, I, I think he was already there waiting for him. I think he knew where that shooter was going. That's Will Dodoris in goal. Oops. Good tip play there by Jamaica. Big skip pass, shot high and wide. Jamaica loves these skip passes. Not really looking for the adjacent pass here, just looking for the home run pass. Hungarian uh, defenders have not really been able to pick too many of these off. I would be screaming for to have my sticks in the lane more. But they have had solid goaltending, bail them, out, bail them out of a couple of these. Great help by the defender there. Oh, I thought he still had it. Ball's on the ground. Hungary comes up with a turnover. And, and you're going to need that. Literally ducked that check. Now Jamaica gets their offensive people back on. Stick fake, shot. It's a great individual effort there by number seven. I believe he's got one earlier in the game. That's Evan Redwood. 
Evan Redwood. I do remember saying Evan Redwood's name. We do have a 4-2. 4-1? Four 4-1, four one? Four one, I believe. 4-1. Ah, Hungary has not responded yet. That'll be a 4-1 lead for the Jamaican team. Wave to the camera there. You will see a number of these Jamaican players on the national team in Natanya. Fancy new team helmets here, national team helmets. Hungry as well. Some of the, uh, the ground ball by George Rohisny. Rohisny. Jo Rojo. I don't know. I, I, I struggle with your name, Rojo. I'm sorry. But George is on the national team, was part of that push to get the European Championships. There's a knockdown pass. Whoa. And that'll be laundry. And we got a flag. We'll have a hungry man up. As Jamaica gets called for. The officials are not going to tell the table nope, what the, the call was. I'm going to put shame on this gentleman right here. Oh, here he comes. Push. Thank you. Spoke and Hungry soon. goes man up for 30. But it started with that, it started with knocking down that skip pass, you know, as I briefly mentioned before, Jamaica has had, had no problem skipping that ball through until that pass was knocked down. That was the first one they swatted it down and they were able to get a ground ball and take the contact and now they're man up. Yeah, a little, a little fake flip. A shot high to high will not fly, and Jamaica will run out the rest of this 30 minute or 30 second, 30 minute. Wow, that would be quite the penalty. 30 second penalty. Another good save by Dodoris in goal there. And it looks like gold is going to be called for offsides, but they had possession. There will be no one serving. Just a turnover of possession. Jamaica talking it over, try to figure out what happened there. It looks like the uh, releasing penalty ran into the defensive end, as well as the attackman who was holding him on sides beforehand. So we are even. Everyone is squawking and trying to figure out exactly what's going on. It's seven o'clock in the morning for the referees as well. So we'll just have to uh, give everybody a little bit of a free pass here. Hungry back on offense, six on six. Coach Sean Church just did 15 push-ups <laughs> for Jamaica. His penance for that foul. I didn't move the camera to it, I probably should have. Sean Church is an OCC grad and placid buddy of mine. I haven't said hi to him yet, because I'm a bad friend, but I will. That was a good offense. What's the number there? I didn't get it. rag behind the goal there. Great, great way to draw the slide. That is a coma slide. The slide came from across. C-O-M-A, come across. The back side, yep. Let's see, I'm gonna zoom in on you, fella. Six, six in white for Hungary with the goal. That's Tyler Martin. Tyler Martin with the nice, just one-timer goal. We really should be talking about the assist. I, I, I lost his number. Yeah, I, don't, the, I don't have that. It was a nice feed. Yeah, it was all the feet. You know, he just had to be next. there in the right place and just swat it into the goal. But 4-2 in favor of Jamaica. And Jamaica comes up with a face-off. A little unorthodox uh, attempt to pass to a teammate. Jamaica I was, I makes up for the mistake by uh, the face-off guy there, number zero, by just an absolute sweat equity play. Uh, wait, everyone, ground ball stats are getting padded today yeah, a little, of these turnovers. A little crazy oh, wow. here. Talk about just being right place, right time. Number 44, 44 for Jamaica. Tally make it 
Rob Kelly, the long stick. Rob Kelly, the long stick. Pick, just picked up the ground ball and put right it Right place, right time. Solid overhand, just placement, just puts in the goal. Puts to make up five to two over Hungary. 2018 Heritage Cup. Providence, Rhode Island. Brian and Dan Whitmer on the microphones telling you all kinds of cool stuff about Jamaica <laughs> and Hungary. Everything you want to know. Everything you'd ever want to know. I do not know what we're talking about here. These are runtime halves, runtime quarters in FIL play. I always, always wonder if the referees understand that it's running time. He's got the ball on the back of his stick. He does have one shake to get it out. There it is. That one shake was a shot. Like Brian said, it seems like every face-off, every uh, every offensive possession consists of three or four ground balls here. Every clear. <laughs> and here's a ground ball. Picked up by Jamaica. Oh, dropped by Jamaica. Ground ball by Jamaica. <laughs> and and dropped by Jamaica. Ground ball. Ground Hungry. Ball hungry. Glad we're not and keeping this stat. And ground the ball. <laughs> Fight hungry. Like said, if, if either of these teams improves on taking care of the ball. Um, either improve on taking care of the ball or improve on your ground ball, you know, <laughs> performance. <laughs> if, you're, if, if your team's going to throw the ball in the dirt, at least be the team to pick it up out of the dirt. Hungary and Jamaica both doing a great job on the ground balls. I might, I might think there's a small advantage to Jamaica in favor of ground balls. And another loose ball here. The home run check. Call it a home run check because it's not always the best check to throw, but when you do get it, it is a home run. All or nothing. Ball down, ground ball hungry. <laughs> and we got a... Ouch. Oh, that'll hurt. Looks like he just got the wind knocked out of him, just a check to the gut, maybe? Not sure where he got that. I don't know. He didn't see the second defender behind him. They have uh, roughly six minutes left in this game. And both teams take a quick break here while I think he has just had the wind knocked out of him. Hungry and player. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. This is one of those just. He stopped short and uh, didn't see the didn't see the Jamaican player getting back in the hole, and I don't think the Jamaican player was expecting him to stop short. Yeah, well. So they collided. And I think uh, he's had the wind knocked out of him. The hungry player dropped. Yeah. Looks like he's all right. Not something you really want to stop a game for. But uh, glad he's okay. Both teams will take advantage and talk a little bit about what's going on. That was not a great cheer by the Jamaicans, but they will have all weekend to work on that. <laughs> I'm sure they'll get it straightened out. So we should still have Hungary's ball top here. Hungary is down by three goals to a score of five to two. 
favor of Jamaica. And we're ready to resume here. Hungary's got the ball out top. So they did not make the injured player leave the field as they should have, per FIL rules. Oh, another. The ref Again, I think the goaltender was just waiting on his knees there for the. It's another he nice save they, he by knew where he was going. He's, he's quick. He's quick. He's reacting. He's not guessing. I think he knew where he was going. I don't think he was guessing. I think he knew. Jamaica now with possession. Content to make a smart approach on the goal. A comfortable 5-2 lead in the waning minutes of this second half. Jamaica was patiently possessing the ball here behind. There's another skip pass knocked down, ground ball by Hungary. So much for the patience. I think the patience was there. They really hadn't created anything when they tried to push that. One might say the word force that. You don't really want to force that when it's not a great opportunity. Uh, Hungary's going to have to make a move soon here if they're going to close the gap. They got a short stick behind. Let's go see what they try to do here. Attempted. Throws that off his back foot. That's a tough pass to make. Ground ball by Jamaica. And Jordan Williams with the, uh, the left-handed finish there. Nice catch and finish. A one-time Glasgow Clyde Sider, Jordan. <laughs> Isn't everybody a one-time Glasgow Clyde Sider? They're lucky. <laughs> Two-time Glasgow Clyde Sider, I believe. Yep, two. Maybe three. Definitely two. So Jamaica takes their commanding 6-2 lead here with uh, approximately two minutes left. Another ground ball on the face-off. Good face-off draw. Good way to pull it behind him. If Jamaica's smart here, you just hold the ball pretty much. We're down to a minute or two. We're up by four. The game on the adjacent field is down to under a minute, so we we oh, I'm not sure that's official or not, but we're probably not too far off that. Jamaica turned the ball over, but came up with a big ground ball to regain possession and work the clock a little bit. Dan, there's a there's a possibility that none of this is being recorded whatsoever. If we if we plug that, I'm th the only thing I can think of is we plug that 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 cord into the wrong hole at the, on the camera. Actually, uh -huh. it was supposed to go in the bottom hole. We plugged it in the top hole. So we'll, oh. go, we'll go over between games. Ground ball for Jamaica. Compare notes. <laughs> Pad no stats. A nice trail check by Hungary. Oh, 
Shot save. And that'll do it for the game here with 6-2 final in favor of Hungary. Get your goalies, boys. Run led by Coach Sean Church to get to the goalie. Both goalies played pretty well. They did. They did. All right, a final of 6-2. I'm Brian Whitmer, joined by Dan Whitmer here for this first game of Saturday morning at the 2018 Heritage Cup in Providence, Rhode Island. See ya.